part one, and this is part one of the Mafia, uh, Mafia Definitive Edition. My first time playing this game. Hurry, it's a masterpiece, man. You got to see, you got to see. So, um, let's hop right into it, man. Let's hop right into it. Oh, I don't want to play. Um, we gonna play. Here we go, I know what that means. What? What's the difference? Like, I don't know. Automatic. Let's get right into it, man. Yes, sir. First time playing a masterpiece. Let's see how this goes. Let's see how this goes. Hmm. Yeah. Just sitting there with you. I ain't gay, man. This is the cinematic. Clean, though. How the game look, my boy? I'm trying to go crazy. Clean. It's supposed to be the display since it says a remastered game. It's supposed to be they, them showing up like they, they the problem is they big uh with the graphics. Yeah. I believe the first game came out in 2001, I think. I think. 2020. 19 years later. Um, of course the graphics are what happened for me. I was happy to be able to play something, man, before the place is five come up. I don't even have anything to play. It's been chilling. If I ain't entertaining myself, then I'm learning. If I'm not learning, I'm playing a little. Playing some games, man. If I'm not playing games, I'm going to sleep. This how it is. Alone. 
No self-respecting badges coming in here unless it's the health inspector. What can I get you? Ah, just the coffee. Thanks. Dip your beak. No, thanks. Suit yourself. So, you yeah. said on the phone you might have a proposition for me. That's right. Well, if you're looking to set up a gravy train, you call the wrong cop. I'm not looking for any uh, associates. Good. Because I'm on the nut. Can't even pay for the coffee. But I got plenty of treat. Let's hear it. So you want some coffee? How long you been in town? Three years. Caught my teeth in Empire Bay. Well, they handed you the Morello case. Right out of the gate. That's what the paper says, ain't it? And what's it to you? Tough break. Case must be getting pretty cold by now. Or you got something might warm it up. Yeah, I might have some. And what's my end of the deal? Uh, you want money? Some sort of immunity? None of that. I got people I need to protect. Ah, families. Always the Achilles heel, ain't it? So who you got? A sick ma or a wife and a litter of kids? Wife and daughter. And no one else to watch your back, I'm guessing. Wouldn't be here otherwise. Pity that. I always said a man needs friends if he's going to survive in this world. Yeah. Well, in my world, it's the other way around. No surprise there. Look, I can't promise anything for your family, not until I hear what you're trading. So, are you talking? Or are you just killing time before they come for you? You think I'm on the run? <laughs> oh, I know it, Tommy. Jesus, look at you. <laughs> Surely gassed. You haven't slept for days. And your neck's got to be aching from all that looking over your shoulder you're doing. No, the way I figure it is you got someone powerful mean on your tail and they ain't giving up until you end up in the river. And you walk out that door without me, we both know you're not making it five steps. What? Yeah, you stick around, you tell me your story, and maybe you got a shot at living long enough to walk that girl of yours down the aisle. Either way, it looks like I'm buying you a cup of coffee. Christ, I don't know how everything got so balled up. No one ever sees the hair pen until it's too late. But you didn't get handed the heater in the nursery, did you? No. I was a cab driver back in 30. I mostly drove nights, because the money was better. It was at the end of one of those shifts, when I first met Polly and Sam. Shit! We need to get over the river. Take the Giuliani Bridge. Oh, okay. Your leg okay up there? 
hurts like hell. When we're back, I'll wake up the doc. I don't know, it might be okay. He's getting the call anyways. Hey, I see you listening, cabby. You don't get to listen either. All I'm doing is taking you guys where you want to go. So do that. Imagine following that. Fucking rules. You need somebody got gun points to your damn head. Okay, we're at the river. Where am I taking you once we're over the bridge? I'm getting tired out of questions. I thought it would be nice to actually show you how the gun to his head. Let me took it now. Some shortcuts that'll slow him down. I don't care how you do it. Just shake them off. That was your shortcut? I lost him tonight. Not all of them. These guys really don't like it, do they? Sometimes business partners fall out. It happens. Yeah. Quit gapping, Polly. The more he knows. More chance of him not seeing the sun come up. I ain't heard a thing, fellas. This shit is crazy. Okay, okay. Ha -ha! You left them in the dark. We ain't clear yet. Keep driving. Poor bastards digging the road for the works program aren't gonna thank us for this. Three crates down. How many motors were at the exchange? Four. Hi, baby. I know with him, he's called for more. He's texting his ass, sure bro. Like Driving on here is crazy. I think I gotta go to regular, sure son. What the if fuck? Hears about this, be hell to pay. Come on, bro. Fuck it. This bullshit, bro. I'm putting this shit on regular. Ain't no way cars move like this, bro. Be behind me. This they must have sent word out. There's more and more of them. We're not gonna last long unless we're back on our own turf. Let's get back to the neighborhood. Uh, bro, whoa, shit. Uh, I thought I could just turn right there and play. First, yeah, we can make it. What the hell are we doing? Just sit tight and pray. Ain't no way you're making it. Now how slow I was just going. Hey, yo, no. Can I switch this setting real quick? There we go. Not before. Me neither. Okay, so little Italy. Now. Your night's not over. I didn't see this coming. You think he squealed? I think you zip it tight. We talk it through back at I can't the bar. Can't tell if this is. Can't tell if this is um. This feel like simulation or what? My bad, my bad, homie. Oh, you shit. You got a death wish or something? Bro, I press X, he just turned to the ring. Fuck with that. Okay, no, I press X and then I turn to the ring. You do this. Okay, we're close. Okay, we're close. Let's get it. Pull over in front of that bar. 
Salieri's place. Yeah, that's the one. Wait here. What for? You want a little something from the Don or not? Come on, they're trying to come on. That's definitely money. They're trying to build up, build the suspense up. Compensation for your services. Any damage to your car. This makes us square. I'm sure it's more than enough. Good. Don Silieri wants you to know that he's very grateful. So if you ever need anything, maybe a loan, or some honest work. Don't hesitate to ask. Don doesn't forget his friends. Yeah, okay, thanks. <sighs> One more thing. This matter stays between us. Anyone asks where you got that money, you want it at poker. Scratches on your car. You swerved. To keep from hitting a little old lady. You got it? Of course. Scratches. See you around, kid. What about the bullet holes? That's tough. See you around, kid. He looking about as old as you, man. <laughs> What's going on, man? This is being bruh. The envelope. I bro. could have had a heart attack. Enough to fix the cap. <laughs> Nearly enough to buy a new one. Mm -hmm. Thought about what Sam said about work. I wasn't interested. The money was good, sure, but I didn't want to get in with criminals. Better to be poor and alive than rich and dead. So, right there, back then, I was out. Can't be out of something that you're never in. So... Okay. There won't be no more of this when the place is five. Come. Load and screen. After that night with Celieri's guys, I was back working as soon as I could. But it felt different. You get a lot of time with your thoughts when you're a cabbie. And other people's thoughts, too. You there, driver? Yes, ma'am. Are you driving or loitering? Driving, ma'am. Always driving. <laughs> Bro, you get in. I'm about to get used to that. I'm used to pretty damn. You know I mean? So where to? St. Michael's Church, directly. She said no taking shortcuts. Careful, right. please. I always drive careful. Then you'd be the first. Come on, brother. What is he doing? He troubling me. Oh. Get off. I With can't hear myself think. That's much better. So, church. It's Sunday already. Eyes on the road, please. <laughs> I hear that. Must be tripping. Oh, no, no. You ain't about to finesse me like old boy did.
Bitch, what's up? Oh, getting on the trolley, I believe that's what that's called. Do they even have them in Chicago anymore? Bro, I'm trying to go too, man. This game do look nice, though. What do they do? Get the police. Why, why you just stop in the middle of the street, man? <laughs> what was that? What was my character doing? He's looking at the floor, wasn't he? I don't even know his name yet. I don't think, no, I don't think anyone said it. We will see. Stop there, Dang. by the park. I thought dude was gonna run. Run the stop sign. Hey, <laughs> imagine me stopping right there. Here you go, St. Michael's. That'll be 30 cents. The only cents. tip I'll give you is to stop smoking in your vehicle. <laughs> oh. like I was sitting in an ashtray. You should have said something. Sure. Say. Whatever you say. I gotta get better, man. Talking over the audio, it's that's horrible. Can't drive without the radio. Better find a new fare. It's alright, right? Ah, right? uh, fuck you. I wanna speed past the cops real quick, see what happens. My bad, my bad, boss. My bad, boss, man. I ain't, you know what I'm saying? It's my first time playing the game, getting used to the driving. Oh, no, 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 I'll go first, I'll go first. I wanna look both ways in camera, you can't. Like. Hey. 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 I can do. Look at the police. How can we? Taking some time out. What's it to you? Not much. Just talking. I'm paying you to drive. So do that. Look at them out there. The problem with this downturn is that it's made people lazy. Giving them an excuse. The work's not out there, pal. The work is always there. You just have to find it. I get it. You're a busy guy. I don't see so many these days. I saw this crapshoot depression coming. Saw that before the crash. So yeah, I get to be busy. Your busy day is gonna be looking at old paintings? I have a business meeting there with a colleague. Not that it's anything to do with you. If you ever find a real job, then maybe you'll understand. Until then, drive and quit bothering me. Yeah, yeah, I get you. Yeah, he's talking cab drivers anyway, man. Ah, damn. That's the police. Oh, shit. I'm not gonna get there in eight seconds. Stop the cab. I'll get there sooner on foot. <laughs> Drivers in this city. My bad. Yeah, hit us, Every boy. fair today's been a son of a bitch. Man. Tell us about the next. Bro, it's a green light, my boy. Why you blowing your horn at me, my guy? Taxi! Taxi! 
bro. I haven't seen one black person. Okay. Oh, yes, I have. Yes, I have. I'm joking. I'm joking. Fourth and me. Can you drop me in front of right City How? Troll me. Hey, where you going? What? Right here? Thank you kindly. Oh, shit. Have a good day. Oh, they what? They not pull me over because I was in a custom. We like that. We like that. We like, yes, sir. She wanted to go around the corner. Bro, this shit is crazy. That's crazy, man. I mean, you could have walked. She really could have walked. Man, I got you. I got you. I got you, boss. Don't trip. Don't trip. Don't... <laughs> you turn. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> Let me get up in there. Come on, boss. Oh boy, you look like shit. I've been working since five. What's your excuse? Booze. Figures. <laughs> Where are we going? <laughs> Little Italy. Get for the bug. Get for the bug. Say if boo. I don't tell the cops about the liquor on your breath, you don't tell them when I break the limit. Good deal. Great deal. Got any good fares today? Yeah, some. But never enough of them. Who's got the money for cab rides since the market tanked and it all went to shit, I guess. Only reason I got you taking me places is I am drunk and don't know better. Can't see enough drunk fellas. They're only after the people moving it and selling it. Yeah, but I've seen them go after guys for less. Yes, so if they think they can shake something out of you, they will use any excuse. <clears throat> this city's corrupt as all hell. Sure is. has a coffee stand around the corner. Tell him Lucy I'll set you. Take a break, huh? Thanks. Might just do that. You know, might to it, my boy. Lucio. Oh, them buildings in the back recoverable. Fudge. Oh, shit! How you doing, pal? You remember me? Yeah. No, I don't! Who are you? Huh? Mr. Morello's a little bent. Shouldn't go help in Salieri's goons, huh? I'm gonna have to give you a beating. Just so you always remember who runs this town. Make it so you won't do much rocking for a while, eh? <laughs> Look at this guy. I didn't think he'd make it fun. Let's get him.
Oh my god, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Run, run, run. Run, run, run. Run, run, run. Run, I ran through again. Come on, come on, come on! Run, run, run. Look at this. How you doing, kid? Dino, Lou! You got business with the Don? Nah, we just trying to talk to that cabbie over there, that's all. That right. Yeah. Well, this here's the Don's favorite driver. So anything you gotta say to him, you can say to me. Is that right? Well, I'll tell you something, pal. We ain't leaving empty-handed, that's for sure. Well, then maybe you ain't leaving at all. Hmm. <laughs> okay then. I like that type of shit. Yes, sir. See your boys around. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Thanks. At least we could do. Come on. Let's go say hi to the Don. Don Silieri? Yeah. He's gonna want to hear about this. Chapter complete. Running man. Running man. Call you, son. Thomas. Thomas Angelo, sir. Frank told me you ran into some trouble? Yes, sir. My cab got smashed up pretty good. Morello's thugs went after him by the kind of Tommy helping us. This, uh, taxi. That's your livelihood? Yes, sir. I feel a sense of responsibility here. So I'm gonna set you up with a small loan, enough to get that cab of yours fixed up. Oh, shit. I appreciate that, sir, but I'm not looking for a handout. Then what are we doing here? <laughs> I just want a shot at the bastards who wrecked my cat. <laughs> you hear that, Frank? The kid wants my permission to get into a fight. Yes, I heard. Okay, Tommy Angelo. All the Morellas grills hang out at a bar of yours. Paul, you know the place. Sure do, boss. Good. You can ride along with Tommy. There's a lot right next to the bar where they park their cars. Go smash up a few tin cans, send Morello a message. He can't rough up hard-working Joes in my neighborhood without getting a black eye. Mm. Thank you, Mr. Salieri. I won't let you down. And Tommy, when you get back, Talk about what's next. Week. No one else knows you here. Met the Don. Tread careful, okay? Sure. The boss finished yet? Nah, you got more turns to sit on your ass. Just met the Don, man. Eh? The Cabby, we're helping him out. He's gonna drive the boss? Nah, you don't lose your job, Daddy. Why is it so dark? No way, no way. Uh... Alright, I 
had to come back in seconds and tweak that. I Duh, it was too dark. Done. I am writing to you. I am writing to let you know of my joy to hear that you will be attending the wedding of my daughter. Please, if there are any further arrangements you will wish for, let me know. It will be a wonderful day and for the world to see that the occasion has your blessing. You will make it even more special and memorable. Uh, your loyal friend, friend Giovanni Romano. Romano? I kind of you that reason. Good? Yeah, I, I'm watching. I don't get what his problem is with got it. Polly. I get it. I gotta, do to I gotta jump. Watch out. Uh, wax on. Pump. I thought he was really following me. Prohibition. Here to stay. Lost Haven. Courier. The Daily Picture newspaper. The production itself. Alcohol tour made it illegal. What year is this? Night job 1930? September 23rd. Yesterday, September 25th. Mm. 2020. So that's tough. Almost 100 years. 90 years. In a speech to get a press, President Herbert Hoover reiterated today that the that the noble experiment of prohibition will remain in place. Forced to respond to democratic criticism, Hoover also promised a more efficient and better f uh, funded prohibition bureau to prevent uh, profiteering and smuggling. Page two thirty. Two thirty, two hundred thirty. Uh, and stuff. Look at his head, man. Uh, Bro, he was what? See. What was that? What was that? He had the bottle through his face. His neck was funny as hell. And he was look at oh my. I gotta clip that, bro. Cigarettes, we need them. Yes. Oh, this is a collectible. Okay. What's the prices? Three dollars, four dollars. The bars are closed for you. I'm afraid. <laughs> yeah. Hopefully, you know how to drink a damn beer. Okay, that was crazy. That was super crazy. Anyways, I got places to be. Okay, come through this way. I'll take you to Vinny first. He's a loud mouth, but Frank and Adon have known him since forever. What's he do? We go see him whenever we need to do any uh heavy lifting. To make sure we're well healed for when there's trouble. That's great for food. We're grateful for the Here's Tommy Angel. We're doing a little job together. All right, good, good. Hey, you just need bean shooters or rods? Nah, we just need something to write off a few cars. Huh. Oh, I got just the thing. This classic should do the trick. <laughs> oh! Hey, if the bat don't work out for use, I got a few cocktails here. Aye, aye, aye. Okay. Careful with him, though. Don't want to burn off your short ears. <laughs> Good to meet you, Tom. Just let me know if Whoa. Tom gives you the hard time. I'll straighten him out. Okay, boss. Let me get past you. Bro. I gotta get this collectible, bro. Come back and see me later if the boys don't scare you away. I'll fix you with a gap. This game glitchy. Look at his neck. You can look around, sure. But Martin leaves the room. 
Thank you. Let me get past it, like, bruh. Oh, he tripping. Cops sure would love to get their hands on this stuff. Man, I'll try to get on my way, boss. I mean, you have to throw hands. Ralphie's in the garage. He's a special kind of idiot. He's got a way with cars. I don't get how this moron gets interested to her. But I'm telling you, it's like some kind of black magic. Can't you sneak up on a guy like that? Uh, I'm sorry, Ralphie. I've been busting your balls. <laughs> see, 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 you're still a little limping. Guess we got two, 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 two cripples working here. <laughs> we ain't nothing alike. You got that, Ralph? Sure, 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 sure Papa Polly. Yeah. Tommy. Tommy Angelo. Good to meet you. Like I said, Ralphie here's a crack deck. Well, you bring him a stolen car, he'll make it yours. Tom and me, we got a job to do. We need some wheels. How about this one, Papa Polly? It, it, it ain't a ha 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 ride, but it, it'll get you across to, to, to town. All right, let's go. You're driving. And don't let me catch you loafing off again. One day I'm gonna cut your brake line, asshole. Mm. I don't know what Ralph's trying to pull giving us this motor. I wanna show you something about the good life and you're driving doing? something my ma could have bought 20 years ago. If I know Ralph, he probably got it taken out of our yard. Yeah, that car's fine. It's good to get a change from the cab. You don't have to be nice about it. This thing's a tin cab. So, was that whiskey back there in the truck? Yep. New supplier. You guys deal in broad daylight? Normally, nah. This was their first drop-off. And the cops know better than to come sniffing around our turf. Morello, the guy whose cars you got a torch, he's got more friends on the force than us. But we're okay. As long as we're careful. An eye over our shoulder. Some of the Canadian whiskey that comes through, you want a bottle? Just ask. We'll keep some back for friends. Ah, I'm no big drinker. I used to tip back bathtub gin most days, but not so much now. That stuff's no good for you. You don't have to go blind now, though. To us, you got a line in the good stuff. Well, that's good of you. Thanks. Not just the booze we supply, Tom. It's the places we deliver to. Dames they got in these places, best tables, best food, best skirt, some way to live. Right now, all I want to do is wreck the day of the bastards who wrecked mine. Sure, sure. Besides, all this could get a guy in trouble. Trouble says the guy is about to send fire to Morello's parking lot. <laughs> I got you to protect me. It'll go fine. Well, if it don't go fine, Try not to let him see your face. Either that, or you hit him so hard they don't remember it. I don't like how you treat Ralph, man. I wouldn't be surprised if Ralph really do end up killing him in, in this game. <clears throat> or if I got the option to kill him. Yeah, that was weird, man. How you treating people like that, bro? It was just a game, but stay it up. You can do that shit in real life. Out of order, man. Huh? We're getting on to Morello's turf now. There's some kind of line between his streets and Celieri's streets. Not really. There's always some give and some take. Though in general, we look after Little Italy, and his guys work North Park. And more besides. You're walking on the wrong sidewalk, in the wrong part of town, you start getting a sense you need to be someplace else. You can feel it long before they start appearing on street corners to stare you down. Yo. Yeah. 
jumped up. Who going? Okay, it's close by. Hold on, hold on, just in case we gotta pull up out of here. Morello's goons smoke and jaw up front and leave their motors out back. There's some lazy bastards. We'll put some gorilla on guard duty, but it's always some no name schmuck. Come on, over here. You gotta sneak in and wreck the cars. Send a message. Sure. Why are you coming with? To see if you get shot. Okay. Go quiet. You know how to go quiet, right? Jobs. Yeah, like that. Yeah, he's got his big guys. You'll get there someday. No one sees our heads. No one tries to pop. Gate and up onto their roof. I'll go keep their shot busy while you creep up and jump in from behind. You real good at distracting. That's the best thing. The guys in the city are real pissed. Excellent. Careful. Once I get the money, I'm good. Ah, he's good for it. In a way, he do that in real life. On oh, that peripheral, you vision his ass. There you go. Ha! Ah, ah. Come on, Tom, quick. There you go. There's gonna be more of them. Use them out. See some flame. Bro, how do I pull these out? Throw some fire. I can't, bro. What? Yo! Got a bottle. Well, fuck it. And throw. Simple. Uh, you know what? Let me throw it. don't know how to this come out ASAP you see how I can put that up ASAP let it come out let it come out because I don't got nothing this not going to come out this is crazy this game is Right here, Morello's place. Don't bring in the wrong people. 
Oh shit. Old ways are the best ways. Straight through the gate! We gotta get out of here before the bulls show! Don't let him get away! Drive! Come back! Drive! Oh, no, oh shit. We got cops. So, uh, what do we do? We lose them by driving real fast and getting clear of them. Sounds good. Right now they're pissed. But let's not get them real pissed. So you throw the that the game is glitch. I ain't know you thought I'm gonna talk to R1. I'm trying to get it to pop up. I just got the spamming button. About to do with R1. That's tough. He's gone. Go back to patrols. We'll get him. We're good. Let's head back and see the boss. I thought Celieri had cops on the books. Some street cops. Drive careful. We don't need the attention. Some street cops, sure. But Morello's got the chief in his pocket. How'd it feel? Feel good? How'd what feel? Taking out the guy. Taking Dino's car. Feel good? Yeah. I guess it did. There's no time like the first time, Tom. Don't get better. You think it's for you? This life? What's it to you? Hey, I'm just asking questions. I like asking questions. I doubt that every day you and Sam go and panel beat motors in parking lots. Eh. There's busy days, there's slow days. I've had more of an introduction than I ever got. You never got to beat up Dino's pals and take his motor? Nah, stole enough cars to get noticed, I guess. When I got squeezed by the cops, you never to squeal. And one day I found myself in a yard behind a bar joined with Vincenzo. Ten years go by and I'm still there. So, I got a suit now and Vinny's an old bastard. <laughs> I always thought that to be in a family you had to have more connections. Your brother or your uncle. Or... Oh, some guys, sure. Your cousin got made or you like Carlo whose pop went way back with the Don. That means you get trusted more when you're starting out. There's plenty of us who came in off the street. I'm thinking we get you in front of the boss, then we tip a few. Well, what happened to the car I sent you out with? Dumped it. Well, why? It was a boiler. This one's better. He's mad as hell. Up of a better car with a broken window? Fresh ain't never killed nobody. He was mad as hell. You still with you then? Somehow, yeah. Hey, boss. It's done. No trouble? Yeah, nothing we couldn't handle, Mr. Salieri. Good, good. Sit down. You see Morello? Nah. But he'll be plenty pissed when his boys tell him what happened. <laughs> He's not going to be able to think straight for weeks. See? That's the difference between me and Morello. I'm a businessman. I do everything with this. Every decision I make, it's what's good for the business, and my boys. But Morella is a hothead. And all that anger burns out the brain. And when he gets mad, he gets stupid. You got nothing like that to worry about with Tommy here. He was aces the whole way, boss. I'm glad to hear it. I got a growing business here. We could use a guy like you to help out around the bar. Maybe run some errands. Make sure the bills get paid on time. You up for that? Oh, it'd be an honor, sir. Good. Good. Now, Polly and Sam have already vouched for you. 
But you need to understand we have a few rules around here, so you listen and listen good. First, no cursing on the premises. There's a million words out there. And the man who needs to resort to fuck this and fuck that is just ignorant or lazy. Second, we don't deal in the hard stuff. I don't want any dope fiends in this neighborhood. We'll let Morella poison his own people if that's what he wants. Finally, stay out of trouble with the cops. We only have a few on the payroll. And if you cross the line, the rest will come after you. You understand? Yes, Mr. Sellier. Then I'm gonna only ask you for one more thing, Tommy. I don't keep Paulie and Sam around just because they're strong. A lot of guys out there bigger and tougher than these two. And I don't keep Frank on apparel because he's smart. Though he is an artist with the numbers. All these guys in this room, they're here because they have the only thing that matters to me. The only thing that should matter to any of us. You know what that is, Tommy? They're loyal. That's right. Now, you stay straight with me, you're gonna be living the high life now. But you abuse my trust. Don Celieri, you won't ever need to worry about me. Okay, then. Welcome to the family. Bro, it was that easy. Excellent. Now I'm starving. Luigi, let's see. Welcome. A barman Luigi is not much of a cook. But his daughter Sarah, Maron. With that a tear in the screen, man. Well. This will conclude part one, man. I'm liking the game so far. The Glen game got glitches in it, but it's like funny glitches. Uh, probably gonna chop some of the pieces up and put it on YouTube, man. I can not tell you, man. I'm it up. I'm up, man. So, good first day. Good game so far. Yeah, we'll get right back at it tomorrow. Yep.